Hi guys, it's our Kenneth and I'm back again with another vlog and first off I just wanna say I'm very sorry. I've been lazy, like my laziness can be compared to the fallen valley of the Naira currency. Like which each day it keeps on getting worse. I've been planning to release a lifestyle video I showed about cooking something and let's just say I have been I used the week and I haven't done enough now to plan a 5 minute soundtrack up to now I haven't done it, I don't know, I'm just so 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 tired or whatever so today's video is going to be on fuel scarcity okay. so fuel scarcity okay some people might call it fuel like fuel fuel or some people might call it fuel like where I come from a country called Nigeria and a far away land called Africa where people live with lions and giraffes anyway we call it Fuwe in Nigeria but when I go to high school they said it, it's, it's gonna be called Fuel 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 Don't you like the sound of that? Fuel But Fuwe like one bush big Anyway It's been getting quite intense like Dollar issue Naira issue <laughs> scarcity and no light like what the crap and <laughs> just the other day somebody was talking about how Nigeria is still the best economy in Africa so the guy came to the conclusion that if Nigeria is still the best economy in Africa I don't know who is doing the calculations that means other African countries should be like in the stone ages like <laughs> calling us with their stone phones <laughs> you know that kind of stuff Anyway, it, it is really depressing. Like, there's no fuel. There's no fuel. There, there is no electricity. Although there's electricity right now. If not, you've been seeing this video. You've not even seen it on YouTube. And Naira. The worst one is the dollar and Naira fight. It's kind of like the battle of the century. You can't import again from AliExpress. Like. I can't wait for Naira to come down, um, dollar to come down so I can import, like, I can't wait to import, buying this made in Nigeria stuff, yeah, there are no factories, like, who are we kidding, when there's no factories in Nigeria and you're telling us buy made in Nigeria anyway, and made in Nigeria stuff, especially fashion designers are based in Nigeria, are ridiculously expensive, like, a share, a share could go for 50k, that's 50,000 Naira. That's equivalent to, let's see, let's see, let's see. Um, <laughs> let's just say $150, $180. That's ridiculous. That's so, so ridiculous. So, it ain't gonna happen. We're gonna go back to China. We're gonna pour shit for $1. That's basically like 300 bucks. And where, people? Because that ain't gonna happen. So, you see, people spending their life cycle on fuel. <laughs> don't mind me like it's so 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 like how can a country that has an abundance of fuel sorry crude oil complain of fuel scarcity like even Ghana has constant light and here you don't see them lining up for fuel and your affiliations but we Nigerians who are supposed to be fucking millionaires like each and every one of us ought to be a millionaire because you see we got gold we don't got diamond but in some places in nigeria we can find it we got fuel we got crazy you know cray cray we got <laughs> we got diesel we got we got war again we got manpower and we got blackness and we also got hot sauce hot sauce originated from nigeria like, if you come to Nigeria and test our food, man, you're gonna be tested for water. You know, we don't call it water, we call it water. You know, we're all about the accent that we imported from America. Like, we need, to, that's what I'm saying. The 
taller has to come down so we can start importing accent like I can't wait then we get import accent we'll be like water I need some water like go for a venue tell me somebody, somebody tell you I need some water like you be like bitch what 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 fucking wrong with you what is water I don't know what water is <laughs> okay and you know what um I have come to the conclusion that and there's all of this fuel debacle that Nigeria should have been complaining about fuel scarcity like bitch that's great and I have just proven to you that I cannot stick on one topic like I said a topic and I ended up thinking about something else bitch that must be crazy anyway fuel like I can't even talk on it because it doesn't make sense like what the hell I'm talking about it like we got fuel and remember fuel scarcity oh bitch Something must be wrong somewhere, and we need to stand up and protest. But not, it didn't come from me, dog. It didn't come from me. Don't say, I won't can I told you to go protest. It didn't come from me, dog. You, you ain't hearing from my mouth. So, if you like my channel, subscribe, guys. Peace out. Love, like, and visit my website. It will kill it. <laughs> yeah, okay. Bye, guys.